Hey everybody, Tim and Miranda here for another episode of Sarah Jane Adventures, Season 2, Episodes 5 and 6, Secrets of the Stars. Um, I'll just start off, like, I do not really believe in astrology, like, not really my thing. I think there's some interesting coincidences, and I do think that it's fun to, like, data people, because, like, okay, like, everybody born in July might have, like, this character trait or something, but not, like, a hardcore astrology believer, Except but, anytime me and Jordan are in the room, because we're both Geminis, weird. this one goes off and is like, fucking Geminis, this and this and this. Because it's fun. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I don't know. Like, I'm definitely one of those, like, if you read the paper every day and it's like, you're going to have a good day. Oh, yeah. No, I don't. And stuff that. like that. No. But I don't know. It's And then there are times where, like... I'm, I'm married to like, a Gemini, yeah. and it, there's a lot of books say, like, Leos and Geminis actually pair really well together. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, okay. Because Geminis and have, like, the personality multiple... personality traits in general. Mm. When it comes to astrology, I I think usually fit pretty damn well. Okay. Um, so all of that being said, you probably got more out of this one than I did, which is fine, because I got more out of the yeah. clown than you did. Yeah. Um, what did you think? Uh, it wasn't too... I I don't think it was too bad. I did think it was, like, a little weird, just, like, the, like, brain takeover and everything like mm -hmm. that. Because um, it was more, like, hypnosis mm -hmm. in general, not, up, like... down. Yeah. Up. I don't and care so, if you're a like, fucking Leo, a Gemini, what. <laughs> like, you're not going to be able to go up, up, down, yeah. because of your star sign. Oh, like, yeah, no. that's not a thing. That's why. And, like, it just, it reminded me almost like a magic show, like, mm -hmm. one of the... Um, hypnosis shows and stuff that they that people do. Agreed. Um, instead of actually going, like, I don't understand why they did it as astrology, like, astrological at all. Mm -hmm. Like, they could have just done, like, a hypnosis thing no. and it would have been fine. Um, one of the things that I feel like they kind of, like, fumbled a little bit was, because at one point they're talking to Sarah Jane about, like, how you went on this journey with yeah. a man, but not a man. He was a doctor, but not a doctor. He was the, the doctor. doctor. And they do a flashback from School Reunion. Yeah. Where it's ten and, yo, my Sarah Jane. Yeah. And I was like, you know, realistically, like, he's like, you went on a long journey, but you came back. And I was like... Why didn't they do, like, the flashback from the fourth Doctor? I think they were just trying to make it more... Like, like to let people yeah. in. But that upset me. Like, if you're going to do it, like, don't half-ass it. Because, like, like, more people know of Tenet. Than... Yeah. And I... Uh, okay, I'd maybe say, not. Yeah, but... no. I'd, I'd say probably... Well, I don't know. That's a weird one. I'd say there's a specific age split. Where if you're like, who's... What Doctor comes to mind... A good chunk of people are going to be like Tom Baker. Because he was the longest running doctor. He did it for like seven years. Yeah. Um, and that's the one like where she left with Tom Baker. Um, but then she that's the one where like he was supposed to drop her off on one road. But it was, the, yeah, yeah, it was yeah, a yeah. different road. Yeah. Um, so I don't know. It, just, it felt like it kind of fumbled to me a little bit. Like why didn't you just show that? Or even just show all three of them. Show her, yeah. show her meeting the third doctor, yeah. show her leaving the fourth doctor, and then show her, like, re-meeting the tenth doctor. Maybe because New Who had already came out when they started Sarah Jane. Yeah. They, like, they thought, like, the, the way that we're watching them in order, maybe that's why they, like, were, like, Well, I mean, this would have well, been over a year ago. Yeah. The school reunion came out long before Sarah <laughs> Jane actually started yeah, that's her true. TV show. Um, but that, that kind of got me, um... This kind of starts a trend that I'm going to spoil a little bit of Clyde. Like, Clyde just seems to get brainwashed quite a bit. <laughs> and I don't know. I don't know Maybe if they just... Maybe he's the dumbest and it's easier. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'm just saying. Wow. Like, out of me and you, no offense, you would probably get brainwashed. No. Bullshit. No. <laughs> yes, you would. Easily the smarter one. <laughs> um, smarter I, in general, that's not... That's all I got. Um... <laughs> I still to this moment we didn't rewatch it, but as like even my husband Jordan sat down and watched this one, and I was a little bit upset. And Jordan's like, <laughs> "What's wrong?" And I was like, "Well, you see how he's going around and he's like hypnotizing everybody based off of their star sign." And Jordan's like, "Yeah." And I was like, "They never said Leo. Like they kind of left me out." 
and he's me like, and Jordan both thought, like, at it some was Libra. point during the episode that he did say they Leo. They never say Leo in this whole we episode. we also never went back to double check to see. Because I'm right. It's okay. Um, I feel like he knows Which is my wrong, Leo trait. that's why we haven't actually went we back and We can go back and rewatch it right now. I don't give but... a fuck. I love being proven I'm right because I'm always right. I'm always right. I'm always right. I'm always right. Hmm. Always Weird. Right. So, but yeah, they never say Leo in this whole episode. Never one time. <laughs> they never say Leo. Only a Leo would be upset. And that's, and I told her, I was like, you know, they probably specifically <laughs> wrote it that way. Because they're like, you know, the most egotistical sign is going to notice that they yep. never say yep. his name. And guess what? I did. So, fuck you. So, whatever. <laughs> um, But they say Gemini like nine thousand times it's because they need to because in awesome. this one like clyde's a gemini oh fuck who else is a gemini everybody's a fucking gemini in this whole episode and even when he starts going around taking over everybody he starts with gemini <laughs> and i was like oh my god well because so, i think that that was the whole point of like where the stars were and stuff they were like i don't know how it all works but like they were like in the gemini thing and that's what yeah fuck you does that make sense? No. Anybody? No. Anybody just like who a, knows anything about astrology? Just like astrology, like it doesn't make Mercury sense. Mercury coming in, retrograde something something. Like, please explain this to us. No, we're lost. <laughs> um, that's all I got. And then, of course, oh, Lee, uh, Luke, who was never born, so he doesn't have an astrological sign. Yeah, because he doesn't have a birthday. Breaks, which means he's the, the Leo. Um, is able to save the day. Like Leos do. Gold fucking shit. Uh, and he's able to like break the connection. Whatever. Because he is the exception. Because he's Kyle XY uh, and he uh, has uh, no belly button. He has no belly button. <laughs> um, that's all I got. Any, anything else? No, that, that was really it for this episode too. Yeah. Go Geminis. Go, go Leos. Geminis. Fuck Leos because they don't get mentioned. Yeah, we don't even get mentioned. So we'll just go fuck ourselves. Actually, not all Leos. Just this one right here on the couch. Word. So. Um, that's all I got. Anything else? No, that's it. No, nope. okay. Uh, for those who have seen it, what is your sign? Go ahead, let us know. <laughs> um, I saw the sign. What did you think <laughs> about uh the doctor? Like, would you have rather have seen clips of other doctors, or were you just fine with the tenth doctor? Uh, what do you think about Clyde being brainwashed? What do you think about the signs? Is Leo mentioned, or is it not? Mm. It's not. Go ahead, let us know, and we'll see you guys next time for Mark of the Berserker.